Gotta get a sip of this drink. Hello, beautiful people, and welcome to my kitchen. Today we are doing my first ever cooking with Kay on my YouTube channel. Um, I post a lot of recipes to Instagram and TikTok, but I've never done like a long form version of it, so I'm pumped. I'm gonna take you through one of my favorite recipes that is literally my current fixation. It is a crap, what is it called? Is it Baja salmon bowl? I need to start this over. I'm gonna take you through how to make my favorite bang bang salmon bowl. It is so easy, so simple. I do not cook extravagant meals, so with this series, you'll be able to expect super simple, time efficient, healthy, high protein, balanced meals. With that said, today we are going to be making my Bang Bang Salmon Bowl. It is one of my favorites. I am currently fixated on it and have it at least two or three times a week. Without further ado, let's get into the video and I'm gonna show you how to make it. It's freaking difficult. Okay, now we're gonna start the veggies. I'm gonna measure out about 85 grams of cauliflower rice. You don't have to measure this out if you don't want to. I just find that these measurements, whoa, just work best for me. That was way more than 85 grams. <laughs> we'll take out this big wad, okay. Okay, <laughs> you didn't see that. Next thing we're gonna do is we are going to add veggies. I just, blah, 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 blah. I add a lot of them. I actually use the rest of this bag. I need to get more. Um, load it up with veggies, okay? The veggies are gonna give you fiber and they're gonna keep you full, which we, we want that, okay? We're gonna add 85 grams of edamame or 95, that works too. Now I have this pan over medium heat and we're going to add some coconut aminos in there and then some extra salt and pepper just for taste. Start prepping our salmon. So we're just gonna slice it into little cubes. We're going to add these to a bowl, pour a little bit of your buffalo sauce. I really just measure with my heart here. So if you like it more spicy, obviously add more or less spicy, a little bit less. We're gonna do a little bit of pink salt or sea salt, whatever salt you're heart desires paprika boop, 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 boop. same thing as a buffalo sauce if you like a little spice add more ground black pepper and we're going to once again measure with our hearts don't hate me i don't really measure with like teaspoon tablespoon i just kind of like wing it but it comes out great every time now you're going to get messy you're literally going to toss this with your hands so that every single piece is perfectly coated with buffalo sauce and seasonings and then when you're done doing that it will look like this. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go wash my hands and we're gonna pop this in the air fryer. Now that your salmon is all coated with the delicious flavors, we are gonna pop this baby in the air fryer. Make sure every piece is kind of spread out and that they're not on top of each other. And it's like little salmon nuggets, okay? We're gonna put them in the air fryer and we are going to bump this baby up to about 380 and we're going to do it for about eight minutes and while this is cooking we're going to move over to the veggies so we have the air fryer going with the salmon meanwhile we are also multitasking the veggies are cooking these will probably take five to eight minutes just give them a stir every once in a while and cook until they're soft while they are getting soft we are going to rinse and drain these little miracle noodles and then we're going to add them to the veggie mix once this is cooked through so let's do that while the things are cooking, we'll do a quick outfit of the day, okay? Let's get it. I am wearing a cute new set from TLF. I freaking love it. I'm pretty sure by the time this video is out, it will be launched. Um, but for real, so comfy. Perfect for spring because you can layer it like me with a little bikini underneath or a sports bra. But if you get hot, you can just take this jacket off, tie it around your waist. Um, but yeah, you know I love a neon moment. I'm a, don't get my toes. Those are not free. Do not get those in there. Uh, but I love a neon moment and it's making me so excited for summer and spring. In my heart, it's already summer and spring because it's literally 78 today or something. 78, which is incredible for February. If you don't know, I'm in Charleston. I'm so pumped. I'm literally gonna go to the beach after this, which is why I got a bathing suit on. But anyway, use code TLFKLA if you wanna save a little bit of money and be my twin. Let's get back to the cooking. Do I look like a little Barbie housewife? 
How cute do I look? One to ten. Are you gonna talk? <laughs> Here's the non-aesthetic part of my kitchen with all of my dishes and stuff, but I keep it real with you guys. We're going to dump this in here. We're just gonna give it a little rinse a roomy. You're gonna grab your kitchen shears. This is just gonna help you when you eat them later. Cut them in half. It'll make it easier for you to eat uh, and you won't have noodles hanging out of your mouth. So look out for your future self. It's actually kind of morning time right now, so I'm gonna eat this tonight for dinner, but I gotta have a little bite for them. I gotta have a little taste test, a little test of root. Also a fork would be nice. Or should I use a baby spoon? <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is maybe not the best meal to eat if you're like on a sexy date. <laughs> Uh, Cause you kind of have to be like a monster and use your hands. If you're alone, ready to chow down, this is the meal for you. Look at this little taco, little seaweed taco. God, I'm so good. I've had this probably 112 times and it never gets old. It always hits the same. It's always so good. You cannot go wrong. Like I said, substitute rice if you need. Make modifications. But you won't be disappointed with this sip of this drink. That is a wrap, guys. I hope you enjoyed my first ever cooking with Kay. Uh, comment below what other kinds of recipes you want to see. I have a major sweet tooth, so I have so many good, high-protein, healthier desserts. If you want to see those, um, I do a really good turkey burger. The list goes on. Just let me know what you want to see. Comment below. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already so that you don't miss my videos. I'm going to start prioritizing YouTube and uploading far more regularly. Um, and I'm really pumped for what's ahead. TV.